Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April the 11th of 2021. Well, it is titled when black holes collide. So what do we see here? Well, we're going to see is a short video it runs only about 15 seconds, but shows the last few orbits as two black holes collide together. Now, since two black holes can't really do too much because they cannot emit any energy themselves, you would not expect that not a lot would happen there. However, the extreme gravitational fields around them will distort the stars around those and we'll be able to watch that when we watch the video. And they will also produce gravitational waves. Now gravitational waves are produced by any object with mass that moves. However, they are so weak that they cannot be detected, except in the most extreme cases, which would be things like black holes merging together. So it would be two black holes moving at very rapid speeds as they accelerate around each other just before they merge. And that was how we first detected gravitational waves a little over five years ago when we were able to find the merger of two black holes. And since then, we've been able to find a lot more of these. But let's go ahead and take a look at the video clip. And what you'll see as it starts is the Earth's two black holes, a larger and a smaller one, and you can see them spiraling around each other. And they slowly get closer and closer together. And then after a few seconds, they will merge and settle down into just a single black hole. Now you'll see a few things as you watch this, you'll see the stars are completely distorted around this. And in fact, you can see that there are multiple images of many of these stars. And in fact, if you look diagonally opposite 180 degrees opposite, you will see pairs of stars, one on the inside of the Einstein ring, that ring of star like material that spins around there and one on the outside. So if you look on each side, you'll be able to match up patterns of stars that you see there that are being distorted and imaged by the gravitational field of the black holes. So it is the gravity that is doing this and the gravity gravity asks like a lens we call it a gravitational lens when light does this so any massive object can do this our sun can do this to some extent how it was first detected but very massive objects like black holes can make it even more extreme and give even a much larger uh, change and that's what we're seeing here where we're seeing completely multiple images of many of the stars in this image. So studying how black holes collide has been opening up a new field of gravitational wave ast astronomy, which is giving us a better insight into these black holes. So that was our picture of the day for April the 11th of 2021. It was titled when black holes collide. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be flame but not fire. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.